Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. So today I am going to do uh, three Etsy shop shares. I'm really excited about these. So we will go ahead and get right into this. So the per first one is going to be from Michelle at um, Padded Heart Company on Etsy. And I have showed you guys some things I have gotten from her before. So let's go ahead and get into hers. So, of course, I had ordered some more. Oh, here's a cute little note. Okay, say thank you so much for your order. I did not want to send duplicate blue hearts. Okay, that was probably this one. So, since this is referring to that, let's go ahead and pull it out and we'll look at it first. Um, I did not want to send duplicate blue hearts, so I'm making you different blue hearts so you have a variety. Uh, they will follow this order in a couple of days. Thank you, Michelle. Oh, thank you, Michelle. That is awesome. Yes, yeah, so she did not want to send me two of the same things, so she is um, gathering some different material to make me some blue ones that are different from these, which I think is awesome. Very nice of you, Michelle. You did not have to do that. I really do appreciate it. Okay, blue hearts. Look at the little teacup. Isn't that cute? We'll keep that in. Oh, we'll put it back in there in a minute. Okay, so let's see what we have in here. Guys, I love these so much. And I'm hoarding them. Yes, I am. Um, I did, though, if you saw my video on Rachel at Rocks Creations, um, Hashtag uh, Roxy's Weekly Challenge, where I did a cover, which, by the way, a good friend of mine pays attention and pointed out that I was making a cover on video. Because, as you guys know, when I do a journal, I typically like to surprise you guys on what the cover looks like and don't do it on video. Um, but, yeah, that was the uh, challenge, was to do a cover of an old book so yeah she got a kick out of that but anyway story goes i used one of uh michelle's padded hearts oh look aren't these cute uh on the front of that journal so you know i'm venturing out guys and using some of my stuff because i look like a pack rat at this point look at how pretty that is love blues these days for some reason not sure why those are super super cute love those okay and you guys know how i am so i'm sorry with the you know craziness that i do okay there's those and i can reuse this tissue paper guys so you know, try not to tear it too bad although having said that it's not working out very well is it Okay, let's see what these look like. Oh, look at the polka dots. Oh, how cute. Look at that, guys. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's so... Gonna go on the front of a journal. Look, guys, how precious is that? Absolutely beautiful, Michelle, and I can't wait to get the other sets of blues. Like I said, I'm not sure what my issue or well it's not really an issue but obsession obsession if you will with blue is here lately i think guys it is in brooke's fault as you all know i am doing the um okay guys these are the pink hearts i you know my signature color is pink uh i'm doing the um hashtag 52 tags handmade by ann brooks and I think the first video or second video, maybe she used blue. And for some reason, it just struck me as so, so pretty. So, yeah, a little bit obsessed now with blue. All right, pink. I can't wait to see the pink. Get off of their tape. Okay, let's see. How cute are these? Oh, goodness gracious. Too, too cute. Wow, I love these so much. Okay, so there's that one. 
Now let's see the other ones. Oh, look at that. Is that like plaid? Look at how cute, guys. If y'all have not went over there and checked out my shell, you definitely need to. These things are so cute. The smaller ones would look really cute on tags or putting multiples on um, the front of journals. And the big ones look really, really good on journals because I just did that um, journal cover. Um, with one of these on there in Rachel's um, challenge. Well, that's a hot mess, but you know. Okay, guys, let's see. I have it close. I'm just going to show you. This is one of her hearts. Is that not the cutest thing ever? Look at how that turned out on a cover. We have to figure out what to make with this. So just a little sample of what those cute hearts would look like. Super cute. Love it. I am keeping all of my uh, stuff together on everyone's challenge until the challenge is over. And then we maybe, which like, you know, it's going to be like a year, guys. Um, or a little less than. Okay, this is the voyage. Um, but we, uh, at the very end of it, we'll just flip through and look at everything see what we have and then maybe at that time next year we can actually use those things these are maybe the first challenges I've been involved in and of course I've I'm at three because you guys know I'm doing Rachel's I am doing uh, Marguerite Miller's I am doing um, Ann Brooks and I'm also thinking guys about doing because I got them out um, Amy, and I'm behind on my videos, is doing some kind of challenge with, um, yeah, rolling the dice. I printed out the prompts. I know, I'm getting off cue here. Um, the roll the dice challenge, uh, by Crafty Cat. And you use dice, and you roll the dice for each one, and then you use those items. So, yeah, that should be fun. So, I am trying to get myself together to get that one, um going uh i did watch one of the videos where she did it and it was super cute oh look guys i think i've actually bought these before aren't these awesome love this fabric i don't know how she does this guys i tried and i was so crooked it was a hot mess and did not even look right i don't know what i did wrong but anyway you know some things are not for everybody and a lot of things are not for me as you guys know Alright, those are super cute. So this is Voyage, guys. So let's look at this one. Now I'm not being so easy with this paper, am I? Oh, I see pink. Oh, look. Oh, it's got a little dangle on it. Look at how cute. How cute is that? Oh, and that one's got a shoe. That one. Oh, that's like that other one that's got a little pocket. super super cute and then we have this one also with a little dress <gasps> that's got a dress y'all that might look cute I want to do a sewing journal that may look cute on there since it has the dress so we may do that so that may be a possibility for the cover of my sewing journal I think I went to I don't remember one place but I downloaded some digitals uh, from a couple of different shops, and I do know one of them was Tracy Fox at Love Junk Journals. Oh. Okay, guys, now we have uh, For the Love of Red, and I think this is the last of my purchases. And like I said, she's going to send me um, For the Love of Red. She is going to send me the other blue one and I will I do have some other things coming so when those other things get there I will just show you the other blue one that she sends Let's look at these oh how cute look at these guys absolutely sweet as can be yep love those 
love, love, love. She is so talented. I, um, you know, wish I could just be that talented at something. I am just all over the place here. As far as talents, I can't really pinpoint one. I just do what I want to do, I guess. Oh, these are cute. Look at there, guys. Those are so precious. So, yeah, if you guys have not checked her out, please go over and check out Michelle. I can use that, right, guys? That's pathetic, but I'm keeping that piece. Okay. Alright, you get in there, and I will put you in your special place. Also, guys, just to let you know, the um, I did get some uh, other ones from her quite a while back, and I have picked out some for a possibility. What is this? Thank you. Oh, a thank you gift. How cute. Um, that are black and white that I'm thinking about using for our black and white journal. You would just have to wait and see. Okay, like that bag. Oh, look. Ew, is that lavender? Yep. Isn't that going to look so pretty in a spring journal? Or I'm not doing an Easter journal, but it would look cute in an Easter journal. Oh, there's another one of those. It's so pretty. Oh, look, that one would too. Daisies. Oh, all these. Oh, and a ladybug. Y'all know that's what I call my sister's ladybug. How sweet. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Michelle. Those are so cute. I really do appreciate those. Alright, let's get these back in here snug as a bug, but I don't think I'm going to try to get that back through that hole. Or maybe I will, but it's probably going to end up being a hot mess. Okay, let's see, guys. Oh, well, that's pretty stiff. Look at there. Well, I started to brag and didn't even get it through there, did I? Oh, there we go. All right. Okay, thank you so much, Michelle. So, again, this is Michelle at the Padded Heart Company. All right, guys. The next one is from Amy over at Crafty Cat USA. And Amy is absolutely amazing. And I have to tell you guys something, too, because I have no idea what happened. So, um, yep, let's put that there. We don't want to accidentally show an address. Um, so yeah, this is from Amy over at Crafty Cat USA. I had purchased some of her, okay, we'll start out with these because this kind of goes with the story. Some of her lined stencils. These right here are number stencils. Oh, okay, that's got that in it. Okay, I see. Okay, that's got a tiny, tiny, tiny. Tim Holtz Tiny Attacher. Got it. In there, because I want to... Okay, we'll just do this. I'll worry about taking those out later. So we have a dolly I can use. So there's that. Um, but these are stencils. But I have bought some of her... These are the numbers. Her lined stencils. And guys, I thought I remembered them coming in. You guys know I've got issues. Black and white. Look, guys. We can use these. Are going. Thank you for these, Amy. I don't think these were supposed to come with this. Look at the key. How cute. And the keyhole. Look, guys. These are going to go in our black and white journal. How about that? Amazing. Oh, yeah. So that's what we'll do with these. Um, but I have bought the lined stencils to get back to my story i keep losing myself and uh i thought i remembered them coming in and i thought i remembered saying these are going to be really cool and i cannot wait to play with them but i can't find them i have searched and searched and searched my craft room from one end to the other cannot locate them and the weird thing is when i go to etsy it's still saying it's arriving late but i thought they came in was i dreaming that they came in who knows, guys? I have no idea. But if they don't show up, then I'll just go on over there and order some more. So here are, again, this is from Amy over at Crafty Cat USA on Etsy. And these are number stencils. So they're like different sizes. These are awesome. Aren't these awesome? 
yep, all different sizes, all different numbers. So yeah, these are going to be a lot of fun to play with. So I really like these. Stitzels. Okay, let's see. we're going to get it in here or if we're not. I think it's that. Oh, there we go. Lord Amy, how'd you get it in there, honey? Don't want to tear them. Okay, there we go. There we go. Look at there. Okay, so we have those get that in the trash because I just cleaned up and swept up so we have those and then I got some of these um, pre-made tags and I think perhaps she said these were done on the 3d printer they have okay I'll worry about that later I think we could get them out yep these are so cute and they have the little slits in them so you can you know, put it on set melts and make it into um, little pockets. See? Isn't that cute? Yep. So we have different sizes and then different patterns. These are really cute. Yep. I like these. That one's really cute. Yep, so I love these. Amazing. Thank you, Amy. Okay, let's just slide these back in here. Guys, I need to do some major organizing in my craft room. I tell you, I still can't find anything. We have a sweet glassine bag here that we can, well, I just tore it. Okay, guys, so these are, look at these, aren't these cute? Look at those. Just all different sizes. These are all super cute. Let's see what this one looks like. Come on, fingers, work with me here. Oh, okay, it's just a... Nope, there it is. Aren't these cute? Yep, really excited to make something with these and use those in some of my projects. Those will be a lot of fun. I do have a... Um, I think it was from Artie Mays, her steampunk, which I'm not very great at, by the way. The theme punky, I'm not sure how to go with that, but those will be good for that. And then it looks like she see a little something she made. Isn't this cute? Look. Oops. Come on. Get back in there. Alright. So we have a pocket here, guys. I'm just losing stuff everywhere. Um, see, so I was going to see if I could find something that would fit in there. Yep, that'll fit in there. Oh, who is that? Oh, okay, that's a shop I go to. So we have a pocket here. And then it looks like we have a pocket here. And we have a pocket here. Oh, that's look, that's the right size. I could probably use that to uh, measure about the size of a business card. Yep, that is too cute. Thank you so much for that, Amy. Very special. Look, it looks like it's made out of book page. To have something that you made yep awesome thank you so much for that we will put that up here and possibly with the colors put that in our um, um hopeful journal which i need to yeah get to working in i'm feeling the need okay guys so the last shop and forgive me if i get this name wrong forgive me forgive me but this is paper art uh uh, uh, Lisandra, Alessandra, something like that. So again, forgive me. I will put the links to these shops below because 
Yep. Alright, so let's see. How do we get into this bad boy? Okay, so that took care of that. Look, guys. Cardboard we can use. It'll be perfect for a spine. To reinforce the spine. So we'll go ahead and get this off and save that. So excited about this one, guys. Oh, yes. So excited. Look at that wax seal. How cute is that? Ingenious. Look, she did it on all of them. That looks like a bee. And that's a flower. Now, that's a neat idea for packaging. And, look, you guys know I could take those off and use them. <gasps> Super cute. That is a lovely idea. I think I need to take more time when packaging up my orders. I've seen some beautiful packaging. Which, at the end of the day, I don't think it matters as long as, you know, you get your stuff. But, um, people can be very creative. Oh, yes. Look, guys. <gasps> They're even more prettier than they were. These are index cards dyed. This is a green color. Oh, wow. I love it. Look at that. Embossed. Oh, that's so cute. Like I said, these are even prettier than in the photos look when we have lavender <gasps> look at the heart oh look at these guys look at that wow that had to take some time how did they how did she do that i suck at dying papers oh look guys wow These are gorgeous. And of course you have the dot dolly that sits down in. How cute is that, guys? And then here's a pack of different size. Oh, there's a heart one. Look, guys. That is so super cute. Wow. Amazing colors. See, when I've tried to dye these, it's like they just disintegrate. So I don't know what I'm doing. So we have all sizes of dollies on this. And what is this? It's a, it's a little note that says, Hi, Lori. Thank you so much for your purchase from my Etsy shop. I hope you will love everything. Best. Alessandra, Alessandra, please forgive me for butchering the name. That's really cute. Look at all these embossed pieces, guys. Isn't that going to be amazing? And journals. Wow. And another dolly. Thank you so, so much. So amazing. Yes, yes, yes. love it okay oh, now we have this guys let's see yep I'm no longer being careful I'm so excited guys because I had thought and thought and thought about buying these when I saw them and then they were gone and then I saw them come back and oh look Okay, so this is the pack of green. So, yes, I'm getting more of the dollies, but I wanted extra. And then we have just different papers. So, we have different size index cards, lined and not lined, abridged playing cards. Look at how cute. Just various sizes and pieces. Oh, wow, these are awesome. Gosh, I love these colors colors are amazing and then it looks like we have some graph paper again just different sizes so we got the green and then we got this one look how cute 
Those are awesome. And then we have some of the dollies and some scorecards and bridge envelopes. Some papers, different papers. These are super cute. Lined paper. I love the sound too, the pencil. These are awesome. Yep, love those. And then this is another color of green, guys. This is like a darker. Oh, these are really pretty, too. And evidently, I got two packs of those. No judgment, guys. No judgment. Look at how pretty these are. Wow. Yep. Love, love, love these papers. All right, guys. So that is Paper Art Alessandra. Alessandra Alessandra oh y'all forgive me but anyway yep I will leave the link below so I guess it doesn't quite much matter that I can't say anyone's name yep you guys know I'm a hot mess so you know and I am throwing my dollies around Alright guys, so that is that. So that is going to do it for our shop share for today. Let's see if maybe I'll just leave it out of the paper. We'll put this over here and I will, of course, you know, fold it later. Let's go ahead and see if I can get this back down in here without taking up too much of your time. Okay, that went pretty good. Shocker. And then we will put this in there just to kind of keep it all together. Maybe messing anything up. Okay, we got it, guys. Alright, guys. So, that is my three shop shares for today. So, we have Michelle at the Padded Heart Company, Amy at Crafty Cat USA, and Alessandra at Paper Art Alessandra. So, I will leave the links below. Thank you all so much for joining me i hope you all enjoyed the video please give me a thumbs up remember i am an amazon affiliate if you would like to follow one of the links below to make your purchase i will get a little bit of something back and it's at no extra cost to you thank you guys so much for your support i love you all and we'll see you next time Bye bye